The Rambler stars Dermot Mulroney as a loner traveling the back roads through isolated American towns. This sometimes shockingly violent drama is part horror and even part comedy. From the Sundance Film Festival, it's Red Carpet Diary. Nice to see you again. We were You've over got there at the Stoker premiere. That's right. And tonight we're at the Rambler. And well, you have three films here, don't you? I do. I'm also in Jobs, so I'm having a ball this week. Yeah, so you've been slacking this year, I guess. <laughs> yeah. Well. Um, no, I had a great experience working on all the movies. This one in particular, uh, Rambler, is a one of a kind, um, unlike anything I've ever seen. The existential slams right into the unknown, which I'm hoping to create a sort of conflict between what exists and the metaphysical. And it'll come in strange places, and it will come hard and fast. Parts of the movie you can't tell whether he's dreaming it up or whether it's really happening, and the movie's populated with, uh, I think there's even a mummy in it and uh, sort of a large squirming maggot and things, so uh, one guy's head blows up. If you want a horror movie, we got that. If you want a western, we got that. If you want a love story, we got that. She kind of comes and goes into uh, the Rambler's life. She's kind of an esoteric, um, spiritual character. And, um, you know, she kind of brings some love. She brings some madness. She brings some chaos. Um, she's kind of a, a full deck of cards. Calvin sort of came out of here, you know, and got a lot of support from Sundance after his short. And uh, I think the Oregonian was here about two years ago. So um, I'm actually treading his ground. There, there, there are more people stopping him on the street than they are me. 